Hey everyone, Nick with Gold Coast, and I'm going to try and share a quick tip on how I unroll my vacuum hose when I'm carpet cleaning. So here you can see I, I roll them up in um, 50 feet segments, and this one, you really want to put it like in the middle of the home where you're working, especially if there's an angle like this where there's hallways and it's just going to be a pain. It's especially helpful with stairs. But um, you put it there, and you take one end, usually the lead, and you just when you're pulling it you just twist it you twist your hand and that's what basically allows it to uncoil so you just twist it over and that helps to uncoil it and then when you have enough uh, slack where you're comfortable with pulling it then you just pull it uh, to wherever you need it to go and the corner guards also help when you're pulling I mean it's not really gonna scrape off paint unless the paint that the customer used is really bad or fresh but it's just a wow factor and it impresses the customers and so it's just they're so um, reasonably priced that you might as well go grab four or eight of them and so now that the lead is done we go back to this end and we just uncoil that as far as we can get it and usually I can get it to the front door um, there are some homes where it's a long run so I'll have to you know go inside with my second hose but this one almost made it to the front so now that that's done we can go outside and get our second set of hose and actually mine that I use it's 75 feet I left it a little longer because I was finding that I always had to I was always short like 10 15 feet and so I got this hose specifically for outside to make it longer and you just run that the same way you did the first one just uncoil it as much as you need and connect it inside and then just connect it to your truck mount and the reason I do it this way is because I mostly do installs and repairs so I didn't need my hose reel I took it out I only run about maybe a hundred feet to two hundred feet at the most now for the breakdown I found the easiest way is to pull all the hose outside and disconnect each segment from each other and then just make sure they're uh, all free just pull it out so it's just hose it's not going to be tangled up with solution hose and then what you want to do is just coil it up it's real fast to coil and then after it's done and it's in a set you just wrap a bungee around it and that's it then do the same for the next and that's all so hopefully this helps some of you guys and gave you a better idea on how to do it so thanks for watching